I'm Warren. Today I am going to present about living thing respond to changes. The guy roasting a pork chop. Living things can move, they can die, they excrete, which is poo, they reproduce, also need air, food, and water, and they respond to changes. This is a mimosa pan. When we touch it, it will close its leaf as self defense. This is a fly trap. It closes its thing and let the prey get digested by digestive juices. This is a Minecraft rattlesnake poisoning for attack. And this, well, is a porcupine and a well, leopard. The porcupine rustles its spines and and that makes a rattling sound and also produces an odor when it raises its spine. This will try. He will try to use this as an to ward off the attacker. To demonstrate that plants respond to changes, we have two cups covered, and then we have two holes, one on the top, one on the side. And then they will grow. They will go through both holes to reach sunlight. You see that? Then we also respond to changes in our environment. When people bind their feet, they do not grow properly. The long neck people use metal rings to make their legs grow long. Oh my god, that's ugly. The end, buddies. Okay, by warning, I love you.